friends, it's me again and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, hi, welcome. I'm Nigerian Gold. On my channel, I do beauty content, lifestyle content, and also vlogs. Today is going to be another weekend vlog, but before we get into that, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. And without further ado, let's get into the video. <laughs> Okay guys, so currently I am heading out to my cousin's birthday surprise party. It's actually not a party. Well, it actually is. We're surprising her. It's going to be a party bus. So we're going to a location in Queens. She doesn't know yet, but all her friends and her family, not her family, but me, <laughs> know about the, um, the event. So we're going to go surprise her. The plan is to get on the party bus and then it's going to take us all the way to Manhattan. And then in Manhattan, we're going to go ice skating. So that's why you see me cozied up in this turtleneck because we're going to be outside in New York. It's cold right now. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So it's time for outfit check before I forget. I'm wearing this H&M turtleneck. It's pretty cozy. I'm wearing these Zara jeans. And then on my feet, I'm wearing some Comme des Garçons um, Converse. And yeah, I'm going to wear a, a, da, 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 a jacket over this because I'm not sure how cold it is outside, but I'm going to guess it's pretty cold. So yeah, this is my outfit check. Here's how I look. And yeah. Okay, so let's finally head on out to the door. Okay, bye. Thank you. Cousin, say hi to my vlog. <laughs> hi, cousin. Come, cousin, say hi to my vlog. The birthday girl. Oh, my it's my it's it is on. <laughs> <laughs> Show me the fit. <laughs> <laughs> Cut that out. Okay, redo. Okay, redo. Okay. Hey, girl. Hi. Okay, we need to get the fit check. From. Okay. Fashion Nova. Fashion Nova. The boots. Misguided. Ooh, okay. And the hair. Allie. Allie, okay. Who did the beat? Okay, that's right. No, that's right. Guys, my cousins are back there. Let me put it this way because I think this is the YouTube way. What happened? Is it closed? It's closed. Guys, it's, it's closed. closed. <laughs> it's closed. I really have to be. Esther. It's closed. We're supposed to be going to the bathroom at McDonald's and it's closed. <laughs> We're in the city of Manhattan. Uh, and I kind of have to pee so bad, but it's closed. Why do they still keep walking after we said it's closed? <laughs> New York City. Oh, this lighting is great. Okay, I'll catch you guys whenever. Hey guys, <laughs> so um, I'm so sorry I could not record anything for the party was because the music was playing copyright. People were having fun. It was dark. I just could not record anything. So currently, um, the time is. <clears throat> I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but my voice is cracking. The time is 124. My my big cousin is dropping me home. And then after that, that's literally it. I really thought this day we didn't get to go ice skating because we got to the um party bus and we just made extra stops, unnecessary stops. The bus driver was waiting for mad long. For other people and for no reason as well. Um ice skating, they close at 
10 30 10 30 was the last slot and 10 30 was the one that we was the time that we chose to go so we got to the city like later than 10 30 so we could not do ice skating um so the bus driver just decided to drive us back and yeah that's basically what is going on was not really that much eventful unfortunately i really thought we were gonna you know do stuff but you know i just wanted to update you i'm currently on my way home so i'll see you okay guys <sighs> okay um your girl is back so your girl is back home by god's grace the time is let me go check what the time is the time is what is it saying 2 235 225 time is 225 um <laughs> what is, I don't know, I'm so delirious um what I'm gonna do I am going to go take off my makeup I'm gonna go straight to sleep I'm not looking at anything oh my I didn't go ice skating really quick let me just rant to you guys before i go to bed i'm kind of annoyed that we didn't go ice skating only because that was part of my content you know but ice skating didn't happen because just the time management was very poor didn't happen. um tomorrow i don't have anything planned but hopefully something might come up who knows i doubt it though but you never know something might come up but if not should i just close this vlog out then but anyways i'm gonna get head to sleep gotta take all this junk off my face head to bed because i'm so exhausted so i will see you guys hopefully tomorrow if something happens if not then we leave it up to God. Okay? Bye. Hey friends. So, um, I would be lying to you if I said it is the next day. It is actually two months later. <laughs> no, 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 not two months. A month and some change later so the previous clip that you saw was me celebrating my cousin's birthday and what happened i even forgot what i told you guys i was supposed to do i think i was supposed to hang out with my siblings go to area 53 i think that was the plan but that just never happened time just passed things went on and i just never finished the vlog so i just decided to finish the vlog um today we are in march going to april so that's my bad this wasn't really planned so i'm just going to let you guys in on what's going on right now right now what i'm currently doing is pretty much nothing i can't even lie to you i wanted to like take an hour out of my day this sunday to read um to read a chapter or two chapters of a book that i'm currently reading and i just want to talk a little bit about the book this book has been pulling on my feelings so much i have never had a book make me cry this book has made me shed tears tears and if you if you've watched if if you watch my um vlogs or my videos um continuously god bless you but you know that i always complain about maturing and growing and i feel like as i'm maturing and growing i'm starting to cry more easily which is a problem for me because this was not <laughs> this is what this was not my life for a long time i would say from when i was very young very very young to about 19 20 i would say crying easily was never my thing never my thing that's all my little sister's thing 
And now that I'm, I, I easily shed tears, it's really mind boggling to me, but I digress. That's something else. Um, so this book is just it's so great it's so good i don't even like words will always fail me how i feel about this book so what i'm gonna do is um spend a few hours reading and then uh i'm gonna meal prep for the week today's sunday so i have to meal prep for the week i'm gonna be making chicken i'll show you guys because i feel like I, I sound very dense and then in the evening i'm going to go do laundry so that's literally that's literally it for today. And something's been, been tugging at my heart. I feel like one day I want to discuss. I want to sit down with you guys and discuss like my absence. I mean, this happened last year. I feel like I'm a bit more. I'm a bit more consistent with YouTube more than I was last year. But there's a reason for that. I feel like I want to discuss why some of the things that happened last year and what how that resulted in me not being consistent on YouTube. At the beginning or ending of my videos, I always tell you guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. Yada, yada, yada. And why, who am I to now say for you guys to subscribe to my channel and then I'm not consistent in making videos? I feel like that's really poor. That's not a good character to have. And I feel like last year was exactly that that I was doing. I would say, you know, and I still, I mean, I still say that now, but basically I wasn't really, I wasn't, I was terrible last year in being consistent on YouTube because of certain things. Um, I feel like I want to explain that because I, I honestly don't have to explain myself to anybody, but if people are subscribing to me, why are you not being consistent and creating videos for them to watch? You know, and I'm not saying my life is all about YouTube or me creating content, but I feel like people subscribe to your channel. The least you could do is create videos and be a little bit consistent. Or if not, life happens. Explain, you know, because we're all human. Explain why you're not not explain totally, but give people a heads up like, hey, I'm not going to be consistent. Yada, yada, yada. And I feel like it didn't, I didn't do that last year. And I don't know, it's been bothering me a little bit. It's been, um, low key, it's been bothering me. The one thing about me, I, YouTube, I enjoy making YouTube actually for myself and also for people who watch. But if I don't feel like, if I'm not in the YouTube mood, if I don't feel like creating content, and not like being lazy, I don't feel like creating content, but internally, like emotionally, if something's going on, I'm not going to be... I'm not gonna uh, put a, a fake smile on and create content. No, I'm not, I'm not doing that. One, that's too much work. And two, you'll definitely see it. Like, I feel like I, I can't fake it, you know? If I'm not feeling it, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna create content. That's just how I am. Um, Woo, that was a lot of, <laughs> that's a lot of talking. So without further ado, I mean, it's not gonna be anything serious. I'm just gonna be reading and then uh, cooking and then, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Hey, Mom Bear. Okay, guys, so I'm here in my living room and, oh, I didn't even bring out the book, the, my book. Okay, so here's the book. It is called The Fisherman and it is by Chiguzie Obioma, fellow Igbo, fellow Nigerian man, support. Support not only because he's Nigerian, but support because this book is so good. But let me read the summary at the back for you. It says, okay, um, the fisherman tells the Cain and Abel S story of an unforgettable Nigerian childhood in the words of a nine-year-old Benjamin, the youngest of four brothers. When their strict father travels to a distant city for work, the brothers take advantage of his absence to skip school and go fishing. At the forbidden nearby river, a madam persuades to the oldest boy, a madman, sorry. At the forbidden near, at the forbidden nearby river, a madman persuades the oldest boy that he is fated to be killed by one of his siblings. What happens next is the most mystique event whose impact, both tragic and redemptive, will transcend the lives of imaginations of the book's characters and its readers. Seen through the prism of one family's destiny, this is an, this is an essential novel about Africa with all of its contradictions, economically, political, religious, and its epic beauty. 
this book my goodness good god i'm up to i'm almost done but not quite where's my bookmark right here so this is where i'm up to okay so gonna start reading Okay, friends, to season the chicken, I'm going to be using salt, of course, black pepper, garlic powder, adobo season, and some chimichurri seasoning. And I just finished um, prepping my chicken. I washed it with um, salt, uh, what is this? Salt, lemon squeeze, and also apple cider vinegar. I let it sit in the chicken for about 10 minutes, and then I rinsed it off. Okay, so here's the chicken. I'm gonna start off with some salt and put this all over the chicken. Black pepper. So the chicken is well seasoned. I'm gonna start tossing this in the um, pan so that we can start cooking this chicken. Guys, here is the finishing touch. We have the chicken over here, and we have the zucchini with mixed peppers over here. So this is going to be um, my meal for the week, or maybe two weeks, depending on, I wanna say two weeks because these pieces of chicken are pretty huge. Um, so I might cut them in half, but yeah. Here it is, we are all good to go. That is it for today's video. I think we're all, cause there's nothing left for me to do but to um, 
Oh my gosh, my heater. Let me go into my um, changing room. Guys, that is the ending of this vlog. Um, <laughs> I'm so sorry if this vlog is pretty scattered and chaotic and not in sequence. There's nothing I, I anyways, so yeah. That is it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. And wow, did that lighting just change? Yeah, it did. And yeah, it definitely did. Yeah. And <laughs> I will see you guys in my next video. Bye for now. Peace.